All right, lovely people of the world, Ghana, everywhere. It's your boy, Mr. Sabali, the only name with a capital in the middle. Today, I'm here with a voice of religion. Voice of religion has to do with everything religious, being it Islamic, being it um, Christian, being it Hinduist, being it whatever. Even if you worship a stone, will come to you, will spread the news to everyone. The reasons why you do it, the, why you are doing it, how you are doing it, and where you are doing it. All right, so on today's episode of um, Voice of Religion, we are talking about the virtues of Muharram. Muharram has, happens to be the first month in the Islamic calendar, and it's part of the four months that um, is sacred in the Islamic calendar. The reason why this month is very virtue or very virtuous has to do with its um, sacredness, has to do with its forbidding nature that people would always be violent. And in this month, um, the prophets and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala entreat us all not to be what? Violent. So I read from Surah to Tawbah, that is Quran chapter 9 verse 36, that says, Verily, the number of months with Allah is 12 months in a year. So even with Allah, we have 12 months in a year. And so what so was it ordained by Allah on the day when he created heavens and the earth? Eh? That is the first, the seventh, the and the twelfth month of the Islamic calendar. That is the right religion, so wrong not yourselves therein. And then Abu Bakr, who happens to be another follower of the Prophet Muhammad, may Allah be pleased with him, said. The year is 12 months, of which four are sacred, three consecutive months. We have Dhul Qadr, Dhul Hijjah, Al Muharram, and Rajab, which comes between Jumada and Shaban, narrated by Bukhari. Why Al Muharram is given this name? Al Muharram is so called because it is sacred. This further emphasizes its sanctity. The words of Allah are said in Surah to Tawbah, as I read earlier on. Eh? In this sacred month, because doing so is a great is a greater sin than at other times. So whenever you sin in this month, it is greater. Eh? So let's say um, in the other months you sin, uh, maybe Allah Subhanahu wa Taala will mark maybe just uh, two or three for you. But then in this month, instead of two, it will be double. So I entreat us all not to what sin throughout this month. This month is very very important. We all are supposed to be sacred as the month itself. May the good Lord who is in heaven protect us throughout the month of Al Muharram. I'll catch you same time next time. Salam alaikum. It's still me, Mr. Sabali, the only name with a capital in the middle. Don't forget to subscribe. I'm out. Ciao.